Hello, welcome to this edition of Ask the Experts. My name is Tina Krisuku and today I'm going to discuss questions regularly raised by candidates whilst revising for their MRCP PACES exam. So the question we have is, I didn't find anything. Personally, I think the abdominal station is either a gift, as in the case of a jaundiced patient with chronic liver disease, or it can be extremely difficult with no or few external clues, as in the case of splenomegaly. If you complete your abdominal examination and don't find anything, be honest and say this. However, if you have some extra time, you may wish to recap certain points during or after your examination to give you a second chance. Firstly, were there any peripheral clues? For example, central access scars, gum hypertrophy, pallor. Next, was your palpation technique correct? In other words, did you feel for the liver and spleen during inspiration? Did you start palpating for the liver and spleen from the right iliac fossa? Were you thorough and did you feel for the borders of the organs, for example, the left liver lobe? Did you roll the patient onto their right side to feel for a splenic edge? Splenomegaly is one of the most frequent exam cases and yet one of the most easily missed. Lastly, and this is a point often missed by candidates, have you examined the back? A whole host of information and clues may be available on the back and easily missed if you're not thorough, for example, nephrectomy scars. Remember, always be honest. If you don't feel a kidney or a spleen, don't make up that you did. The examiners have been known to put normal patients in the exam. Finally, for more answers to more questions like this, be sure to browse our website where you'll find answers on a wide variety of topics. See you next time on Ask the Experts.